now, <coughs> today, instead of starting the video off with a random clip from a different content creator, still with my voiceover, you guys are going to be with me today. Like, the intro is me. This whole video isn't my normal type of tech video. This is my 100th video on this channel. And yeah, in this video, we're gonna be do we're gonna be going through my computer history, my history of being a tech enthusiast, my first video, stuff like that, why I started YouTube, all that. Let's go. Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. This is our hundredth video and I'm really happy. So in this video, instead of talking about tech, we're going to be talking about, well, we're still going to be talking about tech, but we're going to be talking about me and tech. We're going to be talking about how I started as a tech enthusiast. We're going to be going through every computer I ever owned and we're going to be reacting to my first video. We're going to be, I'm going to be explaining my history as a content creator and how why i started youtube and what my thoughts were when i started stuff like that and um i'm also going to tell you guys about a special thing a youtube channel i managed before this channel existed so so i feel a nice way to start this video off would be to react to my first video on this channel and and um yeah let's um let's do it i guess now, my screen recording is a little messed up because my cinema display is a bit of a odd resolution. So I'm kind of have to scale Safari to be like this. And I also want to say, see here when you Google me, uh, it comes up with 140 plus followers. That's amazing. Thank you guys so much. And at the time posting this, we have 148 subscribers, which is crazy. We had a ton of growth this mo month and in January. No, a ton of growth in January, and I hope to have a lot of growth as well this month. Um, but yeah, as you can see, 99 videos, 148 subscribers, and uh, it says 1.4k here because these doesn't this doesn't count the private views, but where I see it, it counts private. <sighs> well, I'm not 100% sure how to start. This. So, hello guys, and welcome back to another video. So, so I guess I, I should explain the reason I said hello guys and welcome back to another video to another video is because before I even started this channel, I had this um, iCloud shared photos album and I uh, used to make videos on there before starting YouTube. You may know me from my album Ramin oh, Sack, I just it. where I used to upload tech videos starting in January of this year. And you might also know me from the now defunct TechMates podcast channel. Oh, 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 2022, Ramin, you just ruined the whole thing. So, well, we'll deep that we'll delve deep into what I just said about the tech ch channel mate thing. Um, there's a lot, to, yeah, this video might be a bit long, like maybe 15 20 minutes. Uh, all right, let's continue. Um, I, um, this is my own channel now. I have created this today and I am going to be hopefully posting lots of interesting tech videos and funny, trust me. I, for some reason, can be funny in tech videos. Uh, this can be funny. <laughs> I, I learned over the past, um, few years, my, my year and Almost a year and a half that I've been, <coughs> I've had this channel, that I shouldn't try to be funny in my videos because most of my viewers are adults, so it would be better to keep the videos serious for my adult viewers. Anyways, I, I'm dragging this part on too much. It's been causing me a lot of headache this week, so that would be know, the first that, video that I'm going to be working on. I've been working on it since yesterday, and I'm also going to be doing car videos with this guy I found in my house. Somehow he's come back in my Hi. house. Hi, Hi everybody. Here. Join us and have a laugh. Subscribe. Subscribe. Aww, did you, did you do so it nice. yet? Yes, me and my dad have done car videos on this channel, and it actually went kind of viral. It got like 100 views when we showed off some hack of cleaning our headlights with toothpaste. I have a fun fact about that video. Actually, so 
the way we made it seem, what, what am I doing then? The way we made it seem is that we know that this works, but when we actually did the headlights trick with cleaning them with toothpaste, it was actually, it was actually our first time cleaning headlights with toothpaste, but we just had to kind of act like we knew how. We also, uh, we also, my dad came up with a bright idea, uh, to use paper to cover our number plate instead of me having to do it in post. Because when I did it in post in my video with the Ferrari guy, it didn't turn out very well. You can go check that video out. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys. What on earth are you doing? And I'll see you guys tomorrow, or whenever I can get the Mac Pro <laughs> fix to do that video. Uh, tomorrow I'll be shooting even more footage for it. Oh my and god. yeah, I'll see you guys then. Okay, that, ladies and gentlemen, was my first ever video on this channel. I um, I will say at the end, why well, like what on earth? Uh, I don't know if you've heard of this Minecraft YouTuber SP SP seventy seven. Uh, I was kind of trying to copy him. So with that, let's go on to the next part of this video. If I'm, if you see me staring here, um. Oh, no, the monitor is glitching out now, never mind. Alright, see you in a minute. So, let's uh, now um, talk about every computer I've ever owned a little bit. So, first off, I had the 2008 13-inch MacBook Air. Yeah, we started off with a Mac. But not, not every computer I owned was a Mac. Which is pretty interesting. Because as you guys can know, can probably tell, I'm an Apple sheep. So... This was the worst laptop I ever owned. <laughs> so, as you guys know from the repair video, these MacBook Airs, all of them only have 2 gigs of solid RAM. Um, I didn't mention this in the video, I don't think so. But they also run off of iPod Classic hard drives. So, they were like the epitome of slow. So... Every few days, maybe a week or so, I would have to format it. It was it was actually decent on Snow Leopard, and it was quite good on Leopard, but Lion, Lion was a disaster. Then I had this absolute chonker, which no longer works. This is the Dell Latitude E5540. It had 4 gigs of RAM, 120 gig SSD, Windows 10. The standard uh, Windows laptop specs. It ran Windows 10 actually quite well. Um... <clears throat> However, Windows 11 ran well. I even actually hackintoshed this thing a few times. Catalina ran like terribleness because Clover is just absolutely rubbish. However, you know Big Sur was actually quite good because it was running for an HD 4400. That's quite similar to the 2012 MacBook Pro. So it actually, you know, could run Big Sur quite well. Now, we're back to Apple. This is the 2008 aluminium unibody 13 inch macbook my unit had six gigs of ram sorry and a 256 gigabyte ssd it it ran catalina the best in my opinion and it could even run monterey decently i gave it to my mom in the end but yeah it was a good computer it carried me through my first few videos not on youtube i'm going to talk about my uh album and all that later on though fun fact when i was searching up a picture of the 2008 mac for this video <laughs> uh the picture of when i installed windows 11 on mine actually came up so if you search mac.com one you'll see windows 11 success and that's actually that shit. then i had this so I gave my parents the MacBook and I took our family computer, the 2011 21 and a half inch iMac, which I immediately screwed up. Me and my dad were upset that we uh, screwed the computer up. So in return, oh wait, I never talked about the specs. So it had eight gigs of RAM, one terabyte hard drive. So we actually messed it up by trying to install um, an SSD. Um, so on these iMacs, the LVDS connector is quite fragile, so sometimes you can break the LVDS port on the logic board. So that's what ended up happening. So in the end, we, my dad ended up buying me my first 2012 Unibody 13-inch MacBook Pro. Not, not the one I unboxed and upgraded in, on here on this channel. 
I got this one in May 2022, and it died in June. Or was it July? I think it was actually July. Never mind. So it, I, um, yeah, it had uh, eight gigs of RAM and a 256 gigabyte SSD. Still 256. Still 256. Yep. Mm -mm. Um, it also had a cracked screen, so it was only like a hundred pounds. But it was a, it was a good laptop. You know, it was fast. It was snappy. I just hated the crack so much. I don't know why I didn't just use it. I almost bought a 2011 15 inch though, okay? Um, I wasn't very smart with computers and which ones are bad back then. But luckily, Andy helped me and told me not to buy a 2011 15 inch. So thank you, Andy. After that died, I bought this. Yes, the computer that kickstarted on this channel, the 2010 Classic Mac Pro. So this computer, once I upgraded it, had some monster specs. 24 gigs of RAM, a 256 gig SSD, again, another 120 gigabyte SSD, ooh, and three 320 gigabyte hard drives. Sometimes two, sometimes three, depends on whether the DVD drive slot would want it to work. The spare DVD drive slot wanted to work with my hard drive or not. So it also had um, an Intel Xeon, I think, X5660 or something. I tried to upgrade it to an X5680, was it? Yeah, 80. But uh, I ended up messing up the CPU tray, so I had to get a new one, and that came with, I think, X5660 or 75, something like that. Um, but, ow. <laughs> but it also had the Radeon RX 580 Sapphire 4GB, and that card was just absolutely amazing. It lagged in Minecraft, yes, but that's because I was playing Minecraft on Mac OS. If you play the game in Windows, then it actually runs really well. The only issue I had with the card is, before I manually flashed the VBIOS, um, I didn't have the boot screen, which was really annoying. The Mac Pro was using a lot of energy, so I sold it for this. My 2012 iMac with 16 gigs of RAM, a 650M, and a 512GB SSD. My dad has this computer now. Um, it was my third iMac, because actually, uh, I missed something, which um, I'll get to in a second, but yeah. So I actually missed something, which is that in January last year, 2023, I replaced the Classic Mac Pro with this 2010 iMac, which I also messed the LD VDS cable on. So then, oh yeah, I also had the other 2012, but I gave that to my cousin. Anyways, yeah, back to the story. But then, I hated the iMac, so I was just like, yeet. And I went back to the Mac. Bro. And that lands us to my current setup with the 2013 15-inch MacBook Pro. This is the base model with an upgraded 512GB SSD. It's running macOS 14.0 Sonoma. And yeah, it's an amazing computer, but there's one more. This is just in my collection. It's actually on my shelf, my new shelf. So yeah, this is a 2009 24-inch iMac. Need a new hard drive and a new microphone, but it has eight gigs of RAM and it's the top tier model. Now I want to 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 show you guys my old album. Let let me try and find the link. Ha! I managed to log in. I've I've sent the link to myself. I made it public, and I might put the link in the description. Who knows? But yeah, right, let's go. Here we are on my album. We're not gonna watch a full video. We're just going to take a look at the album. So, <laughs> we didn't have thumbnails. This is new too. So, we can watch one of my shorts. But, um, the music won't be copyrighted. I don't use music anymore. Oh, oh this is a video with Andy where uh, we went through my old files and it was really funny for both of us. We had a very good time. But, oh, there's another video with Andy. Look at this thumbnail, man. So, so if I wanted a thumbnail, I'd have to edit it into the beginning of the video. Uh, okay, can't show a jailbreak video on YouTube because, um, <clears throat> so does tech. Yeah. Well, this is a video from when I bought the new CPU tray. It has the Linus tech tray. Oh my goodness me! Hello guys! New banger out tomorrow. This video cost me 55 pounds! 
Yeah, 55 pounds. And I now, I'm like, how do I put in this car? car oh my god. Multiple hours drive. And, uh, yeah, we, got, we have to get to that. That, that's oh, I like getting dinner. Um, it's my one of my favorite meals. But anyways, um, bang -a! video out tomorrow. That's how you say it. It says bang -a video out tomorrow. I collaborated with this guy I found in my house. I always make hey, that Hey, hey, say something. Howdy dudes. We just had a scrumptious meal, you know. <laughs> so I actually got the whole... Oh, I found this guy in my house from Miami. Guys, uh, that, that I don't want him to go in detail about the food because I'll make everybody jealous. Oh yeah, X5. We're on our way home. For the finale. Yeah, finally. I've been driving, we've been driving for like, how long? Since the... So that would be like 5 hours because I think I recorded this at almost 9 o'clock. Uh -huh, um, anyways guys, see you tomorrow. If you if you enjoy the video, if you are excited, leave a like. Boy. Yes, that is Linus's intro. Um, but yes, I used to do a lot of videos with Andy as well, but he has his own uh, responsibilities. He has um, a lot to do, and he's also working on some songs. So I can I'm gonna link his uh, band music channel in the description but yeah um it's always fun doing a video with him but we'll talk more about that later. hey i'm sure you want to hear about this youtube channel i ran called technique so me and andy had a podcast uh in 2022 and it wasn't exactly some one of our best moments i mean just <laughs> the thumbnails man were terrible and then the actual video would just be us for 10 minutes being like uh so what do we talk about i don't know what do we talk about i don't know what do we talk about what do we talk about for 10 minutes so eventually andy told me look i don't want to do this anymore so i was a little upset for some reason even though i'm actually glad i stopped the podcast okay but uh we still obviously <clears throat> We still stayed close friends and partners, and uh, because of that, I made this channel on that exact day that we quit the podcast. So, yeah, that Andy's partially responsible for this channel's existence, so please give him a sub. Now, let's talk about another thing, which is something that every YouTuber likes to talk about. Who inspired them? Which other content creators did they enjoy watching so much that inspired them? First, I was inspired by Computer Clan and Crazy Ken, and then I was also inspired by Luke Miani to create the type of content I create now, which is videos talking about technology. And he's also inspired me a lot with my um, future video I'm working on. D -d 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 can't spoil it, can't spoil it, can't spoil it. But yeah, those are who inspired me. Next, let's talk about my history as a tech co as a tech enthusiast. This started back when I was eight years old or so, and I started being into tech. However, I took a huge break from tech up until about 2021 when I got extremely into tech, and uh, I'm a bit too into it now. Now, I think one last thing that we should do in this video is take a look at my channel analytics. All right, we're gonna take a look at this channel's analytics. If you see my mouse goes to go to the other monitor, it's because I have OBS. So to change any setting with OBS, I have to. Here we are on my channel dashboard. Um, we have 148 subscribers. Thank you guys. And we've gained 11 in the past 28 days, which is just wow. Thank, thank you guys so much. So now we're going to go into content. And um, the Vision Pro video has 1455 public views but a uh, but if we go into analytics um we can see somewhere here oh 
But yeah, that we okay. Wait, actually, it's on the dashboard. But on the dashboard, because dashboard counts private views, it does say one and a half thousand. If we go to the video analytics, there's something really funny I'd like to show you. Let's see, one forty-five public. So because there's one forty-five. But yes, I go into audience. We've gained five subscribers, which is wow, awesome. And our viewers are between 25, 34, 35, and 44. 45 to 54? Okay then. Interesting. Um, interesting. But there's somewhere, I still can't remember where it is. So around here, um, there's likes versus dislikes. We actually have 80 dislikes <laughs> on the video coming from um, Vision Pro fans, I guess. Who are dislike and dislike the video for some reason. Even though I don't, I don't understand why people would use Vision Pro fans. Analytics for my whole channel. We've got 2,050 views for the past month. We've got 29 and a half watch hours, which thank you guys so much. And 11 subscribers, and our subscriber count is 148. So that's a little dive into my channel analytics. If you'd like a, a deeper dive, then just let me know. With that, though, if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. You can click another video here or here and i just want to say thank you guys so much for 100 videos this is an amazing achievement and i can't wait to continue making videos i won't be quitting anytime soon see you guys next oh 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 though one, one announcement i will be taking a one month break but you guys won't feel anything because i am going to be pre-recording about five videos to go out like every week during the month of ramadan so See you guys soon.